racing is off, but right on target with an answer to what idle jockeys should do is David Mould, a national hunt jockey who rides for the Queen Mother. He's just opened a boutique at Epsom. David, who's 27, soon acquired the selling technique. Apparently, even when there are no horses running, there's still a run on shirts to put on them. Meanwhile, back in London, when the Beatles open a shop in Baker Street, everything slows down. A rolling stone's throw from Orchard Street, it's the Apple, the Beatles' new boutique. To mark the opening, the proud owners gave an apple juice party. John Lennon and George Harrison were the hosts. The other two Beatles were out of town. Paul's in Liverpool and Ringo's in Rome. Disc jockey Alan Freeman talking to Scylla Black. A later arrival, Richard Lester, director of the Beatles films, among a whole host of the in crowd. <laughs> sale will be books, jewellery, paintings and hippie clothes, as well as furniture. A psychedelic cameraman on the apple juice kick. Among all the Beatles' ventures, this one literally has a bite to it. <laughs> 